haul for you. My daughters and I went shopping this past weekend. My husband was out of town, and so he had been gone for several days, and we just kind of wanted to go on a little road trip to the mall that's not in our town. We had to go over to another town. So really just to kind of give us something to do because um, that was like the third day he had been gone and we were really missing him. Um, but I found quite a few um, bargains when we were out shopping and things that I wanted for uh, Christmas decor. Now, I haven't bought a whole lot of Christmas decor because I have a whole lot of Christmas decor, but I like to get a few new things every year. So, I'm going to start with Marshall's. Um, picked up this towel set. I'm really loving green right now. I'm wearing green. <laughs> I'm really loving decorating with green right now. So, I saw this and I always like to pick up some new um you know, dish towels for the kitchen. And it has like the, the gingham and then the striped green and the Christmas trees with the little pom-poms. I just thought that was so cute. Sorry, my cat was rubbing up against the, <laughs> the picture I have sitting there. Um, so this was $9.99 at Marshall's. And then the other thing I picked up, well, I got a, I actually got a cup too, it, but my, that was for my daughter and I don't know, I didn't see it in there. I think she's already used it and had some hot chocolate in it. So I'll share it probably one day when I'm washing dishes, I'll share that. But I saw this, it's a set of two table runners. It's got the plaid, uh, which is the longer one. It's 16 by 90. Um, and then it has the little Christmas tree one and it's, it's shorter, it's the, it's 14 by 72. So it's kind of like a layering table runner set. And that was $24.99. And besides my daughter's cup, that's all I got at Marshall's. Um, we went into Walmart and I've been wanting some new ribbon for my Christmas tree. The ribbon that I've been putting on it for the last several years um, I still love it, and I'm going to use some of it, too, and it's it's red and white as well, but I saw the red and white striped, and I just thought that was so pretty and festive, and I really don't have a theme for my Christmas tree. I'm just very traditional. I like the red and white, a little bit of green um, on the tree, um, but I just like to be traditional. I'm very sentimental about like things that my girls made when they were little. You know, I know some people, <laughs> they want to have a tree that looks professionally done and you know, no judgment here, but I will forever put their little handmade ornaments and just um, little ornaments that mean a lot to us. We have some ornaments that we got in China. Um, that are just really precious to us and like several times when we've gone on vacations together as a family we got little ornaments so that's just that's what i like i like it to be just very traditional red and white with hints of green and sentimental that's that's just what i like all right i got this it's a nine foot sonoma cypress garland um, I'm planning on putting it down the dining room table. Um, my plan may change, but that's what I'm thinking right now. Um, it looks very real. So I just, I like, it's not a pre-lit one. I'm going to put, I had gotten some, um, like the flameless candles, uh, with a little remote to put in the center of, um, the table with this. So that's my plan for right now, but plans change. <laughs> and then I picked this up and I don't know, this is probably going to be for Christmas decor, but I can see me using this all year long. Um, but oddly enough, the Walmart that I got these at, there were no tapered candles. <laughs> so I don't know where I'm about to go to get tapered candles, but Walmart was not the place. Um, and these were only $4.96 each. So I really like these. This is a painting 
that I got at Hobby Lobby actually a few weeks ago. My husband was with me. Um, they had all their paintings, their art, their wall art on sale, like 50% off. And so I don't, I have a, a painting that a dear friend, dear sweet friend did for me, a little, uh, like the Christmas red truck. And so I always put that usually in my, in, in the, our bedroom, but I wanted something for our living room and we've lived here for almost two years and have really not put any kind of art on the wall. I don't know, just with it being new construction and those walls looking so pristine and clean and no nail holes in them, I've been really hesitant, but I'm taking, you know, I'm taking that dive in and I'm going to be putting some wall art up. Now, we did hang, I have a, a huge clock uh, in my dining room and we did hang that up. So that was like the first thing that we did um, as far as putting anything on the wall. So we actually got another um, picture for like an everyday picture in there in the spot where I'm going to be putting this for Christmas and I'll show it maybe sometime in this video, if not sometime soon. But I saw this up on the wall at uh, Hobby Lobby, like way up, like you had to get a ladder to get it. And so I, I was just like, oh my gosh, I love this. I love barns. Pictures of barns are just, I don't know, it's very nostalgic for me. So this was just something that I absolutely fell in love with. And it was $57.99, but it was half off. It was 50% off. So, and my husband was like, let's get it. Because <laughs> I I'm not one to spend even $30 on a piece of art. <laughs> and I know that probably sounds crazy. Probably some people spend a lot more money than that on wall art. But I just, I don't typically do that. But my husband was like, oh, I know you love it. Let's get it. So. I was like, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had to stop for a minute. My daughter was calling me. I had to answer the phone. Um, but I also have a Grove Collaborative uh, haul, a box that I got in. And I don't have very many things in here. I get this every time I get a Grove Collaborative box because I love this for washing, hand washing dishes. So this is always in the Grove Collaborative box. And they have their holiday scents. And one of my favorite holiday scents is the Snowdrop. And so I stocked up on that. I got two of the cleaners. And then I got two of the air freshener, the room freshener in the Snowdrop scent. And I got two soap dispensers with Snowdrop. And I got a refill bottle of the Snowdrop and it's not in here. So I'm thinking my daughter took it to her bathroom <laughs> to fill up her soap dispensers because, you know, I told you about her not liking the fall leaves scent, but she loves this one. <laughs> and so win for that, she approves of that one. And then of course, this these are two things that I always get to. The hand sanitizer um, spray and the blood orange scent. I carry this around in my purse. And then the big one um, is the hand sanitizer gel in the blood orange scent. And I keep this in my car because, you know, getting in and out and going into places, I always sanitize my hands when I get back in the car. So that's just my quick little haul for this week.